Well, hello everyone. I'm Deb and this is DB Designs and Sewing Australia. Welcome to my unboxing of Neptune's Daughter. That's my bespoke box from the Daily Society. As you can see, I have gotten changed after work and I've put on my Tizuti robe in another beautiful fabric that I got in a bespoke box. The Indian bespoke box from the Daily Society. I received this box at work today and honestly it came so quickly. Now that we've finished rustling everything around I did order some other things as well. What a surprise. So, here's my beautiful bespoke box, unopened. Let's have a look. Now, the first thing I got was I actually ordered some of the lightweight shaping iron-on interfacing some in black and some in white because i wanted to see what it what it was like oh it's so lightweight it's going to be beautiful for summer dresses so i'll certainly be testing that out in the coming months and here is my beautiful bespoke box See that beautiful sticker? Remembering that it's Neptune's daughter. Let's open it up. Managed not to tear the sticker off this time. This is the beautiful postcard of a mermaid that I got. And it's got a beautiful little saying on the back. And with that, I also got a label. Whoops. Mistakes made, lessons learned. How true is that if you're sewing? I do actually have a pin-up board that I keep all of my postcards on. You can see I've actually got a few photos of my grandchildren up on there as well. I will take you on another tour of my um, sewing room at some stage. Well, the first thing we've got is a coffee bag, a Robert Tim's coffee bag, and it's Italian espresso. And that's what I drink. I drink espresso coffee. The next thing I've got is some Lux Aromatic Bath Salts. Lotus Flower and Sweet Orange. And these are made in Melbourne, Australia. It's the from the Sapphire Coast Collection. That looks absolutely beautiful. Gosh, there's a lot in there. And I can see that it's got um, a Ziploc, so you can use some of it and then do the packet back up. That's lovely. Vintage Tropical Glitz and Glamour. Wow, and it comes from a place called Empire Australia. That's gorgeous. I don't want to open it, so I can't smell it yet because it is sealed up. This bag is like it's foil. Really lovely. Oh, and from the chocolate box, peppermint truffle bars. It's actually something that I buy. Lovely. These are beautiful. And for my sewing notion, I got a bobbin ring. 
Wow, I've never had one of these before. Oh, I see. Just pop your bobbins in like that. Look at that. I actually have some, I actually have containers with bobbins in them, but for all the different machines, they all take different bobbins. And I might use this one for my Mariflex because I keep the threads separate so that I know which ones are Mariflex and which Mariflex I've already got on a bobbin. So that will be very, very handy. Coming up with some really good things to have in the box. Here's my, it's navy blue thread. And wait for it, here's the beautiful fabric. This is gorgeous and I already know what I'm going to make. This is viscose lawn. I don't want to stand up too fast and show everyone my pyjama pants that I've got on. Look at that fabric. Look at those colours. That's absolutely beautiful. It sort of has that embroidered look about it, but it's actually a viscose lawn and it's two and a half metres. So I already know what I'm going to make with this. With this gorgeous fabric, I am going to make the Seasons of East dress. That's the second lot of fabric I've got that I know that's what I'm going to make with it. So it's absolutely beautiful, Kristen, and it feels so lovely. It's going to make a fabulous spring summer dress and once again it's that really good quality viscose really good quality I was talking the other day about viscose that was slightly heavier weight and not a summery summer weight which is what I'd originally bought um, that you buy in store but this is gorgeous absolutely beautiful and the pattern that you can get, you can get 30% off. And the pattern is swim style patterns, ritual dress. Now, someone else was talking about swim style patterns. And they don't just have swimwear. They have all other things that, um, all other types of patterns as well. This is absolutely beautiful. I am thrilled. As you can see, it's got a beautiful amount of drape going on in it. I think this is going to be ideal for the Seasons of East dress. It really is. The other one I'm going to make in the Seasons of East dress is my Purple Copra Corsage. I had a lady um, tell me the other day that she had made the Seasons of East dress in her Purple Copra Corsage that she got in the winter box I'm sure it was winter in the special bespoke box from the Dahlia Society and that she and that there's a photo of it on Instagram on Kristen's site so I think this is going to make a fabulous dress and those dresses will be so different to each other remembering that the other one's bright purple and this is a navy background something I actually wear a fair bit navy you notice the other one I made, the Bridget dress the other day, that's got a navy background also. So this is going to be gorgeous. I could make a Bridget in it, but I'd like to try that Seasons of East. And I think Seasons of East really shows off a fabric really, really well. It's got a pattern on that you want to be able to see. Look at that, just gorgeous. So. Let's go through what we got today. I got a bobbin ring, which I've never, ever had. So that'll be really, really interesting. 
I, as I said, I keep them in cases. Not always a really good idea because if you knock it over, they're everywhere. One of the cases has got a clip down lid and the other one's just got a lid that you just sort of rest on the top of it. Not ideal if you're going to knock it over. The House of Robert Tim's coffee bag, which will be lovely. Actually, I might take that on holidays with me. Some beautiful peppermint truffles. How good would a beautiful cup of coffee and those peppermint truffles be? Very, very nice. Very yummy. And just trying to see if it tells me whereabouts in Melbourne it's made. It's a product of Australia and I think it's made in Albert Park, which is close to the city of Melbourne in Australia. So that will be beautiful. Lotus flower and sweet orange. And that's the essential oils and sea minerals that are within the Lux Aromatic Bath Salts. And that packaging is just beautiful. Look at that, that's a very heavy foil bag. Really, really nice. And this gorgeous postcard. It's a gorgeous mermaid. The little poem on the back, and in fact, the poem is by William Shakespeare. How lovely is that? And a little label that says, Mistakes Made, Lessons Learned. Bulls on that. And some navy thread to go with my fabric. Once again, this is the fabric. Just beautiful, Kristen. Absolutely gorgeous. Makes me wanna hurry up and go on holiday so I can get home and do some more sewing. I don't know how I'm gonna go not sewing for three weeks. It's very much unlike me, but you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to design a wardrobe while I'm away. Because I will always have the internet and my iPad or phone. So I'm going to take a book and I'm going to start to list down the dresses I'm going to make for summer. <clears throat> I've turned into a real dress person. I've also got to decide what I'm going to make to wear to frock tails. Our frock tails in Melbourne is in November. So once I get home from holidays and I've finished the wedding dress that I've renovation that I've just got to do the train on and the mother of the groom's dress, I will start thinking about what I'm going to wear for frock tails and what I'm going to make for summer. And some of my daughters have already asked about linen pants and that sort of thing, although that doesn't take too long because I've already made the patterns for them before. So quite an easy sew. Uh, yeah, how gorgeous, look at that, let me do that. This is beautiful, absolutely beautiful. And I'm just loving the quality of the viscose that's coming out of um, the online shops is fabulous absolutely fabulous it's got a lot more texture to it it's not as slinky and as see-through as many of the other versions of viscose or what my version of viscose would be what I used to always make things out of but I started off when I bought it for the Stina skirt and it was the Atelier Jupe and that's what this feels like. This feels lovely like the Atelier Jupe viscose. I'm not sure what brand it is. I'm sure Kristen will tell us when she does hers. Uh, so it's, vis oh, it's viscose lawn. That's why it feels beautiful. 
and it's not the lawn that I made my sister Sue's top out of at Christmas time was very very lightweight beautiful fabric very beautiful and wasn't cheap at all but this has got much more weight to it than that and a different drape sometimes I find that sometimes lawn doesn't drape very well it's very cottony but because this is a viscose lawn and not a cotton lawn it gives it that beautiful drape so many pretty colors in that i'm not even a person that wears orange she says with a half orange dressing gown on um but all of this fabric is just beautiful look at all those colors look at the beautiful blues in it blues greens oranges and the navy background so absolutely beautiful You've done really well, Kristen. Congratulations. This is beautiful fabric. And as I said, I was already hoping for something that was going to be a woven and not a knit. And I thought, oh, if it's got a decent size print on it, like a large enough print on it, I want to make the Seasons of East out of it. So I've really been collecting fabric i don't know how much fabric i'll be able to collect in tasmania because they do have some fabric shops but they're mainly focused on quilting and i do love quilting i do sometimes quilt not beautiful quilting like my sister's quilt that she made for me but because that's what she does she does quilting but um beautiful quilting fabrics when I looked online at Tasmanian shops when you're traveling with other people they don't necessarily want to go to fabric shops and I don't know why I don't know why they say shut up about sewing I'm sick of hearing about it you know it entertains me I'd be listening to them if they were talking about sewing but absolutely gorgeous they get me to make them things and fix their clothes but they don't want me to talk about it so absolutely beautiful absolutely i'm thrilled absolutely thrilled to bits with this fabric really really lovely really nice to start to collect up some fabric that's going to be useful for the spring and summer here in australia i do believe it's going to be really hot this summer but beautiful fabric look at the drape on that that's going to be so pretty so thank you very much, Kristen. I have got something else on the go at the moment and it's actually using fabric from a different subscription box from the Dahlia Society. So it's actually a niche and I want to hurry up and get that finished before I go away. So hopefully I can, it's a long sleeve top, so beautiful beautiful fabric i'm wrapped absolutely wrapped in that viscose lawn two and a half meters and remembering that i told you last week that you can get it at doesn't look terribly directional so you can get it out of this is 150 wide which means I'm going to be able to get it out of two meters it's Gabrielle said the other day that if your fabric's wide enough you don't need three meters you only need two meters so this is going to get us to um, at least that dress out of that just beautiful please excuse me in my dressing gown but you know I had to get changed out of my uniform and decided to put a dressing gown on absolutely gorgeous loving it loving it that's all for me today everybody have a wonderful week 
as I said, please like and subscribe. I will probably not get any more of the wedding dress done until after I come back from holidays. But I've got the buttons on, the press studs on, it fits her, and now I've just got to do the train. I still haven't trim, trimmed off that fabric that is the excess on the inside, but I will actually leave that until the second last fitting, just to make sure. Um, cannot wait to be finished everything I've got on the go and start to make some stuff for myself for spring summer because there's so many beautiful patterns out there and I will have a look at these swim style patterns and it's the ritual dress 30% off that's a decent percent off that's for sure anyway I'll talk to you all next week or maybe on Sunday and everybody have a wonderful rest of their week. Bye.